Boyfriend is pushing for abortion. This is a sad situation. This relationship is definitely over. The choice is yours. But it sounds like you will be a single mom. So definitely keep that in mind when you make this decision. You cannot force him to want to be a dad. Any more than he can force you to not want to be a mom. Your relationship is over. Now the only question is whether you want to raise a child by yourself. If the answer is no then get an abortion. Either way. This relationship is over. You do get the final say. But note that you did say you would get an abortion if an accident happened. I'm sure that he is panicking because you backtracked. Depending on where you live. He may be financially responsible for the kid whether he is an involved dad or not. Just be prepared to be a single mom. He can't force you to have one but don't be mad if he refuses to be in the child's life. He never wanted this and you made it clear you'd have an abortion if you got pregnant. Speaking from experience the hormones make you wildly protective and cause you to think you may want to keep it. All rational thought went out the window when this happened to me. I miscarried ultimately but I'm glad nature made the decision for me. I was not emotionally or financially ready for a child. Think about how you felt before getting pregnant before you make any decisions. A child is forever. I think you've already decided. Which is absolutely your prerogative. But I agree with others that your relationship is over either way. Whichever choice you make. It will lead to resentment. I think at this point. The conversation needs to be how much if he is willing to be in the child's life. Not about trying to save your relationship. And if he says not at all. As hard as it will be. You need to accept it. I think his reaction is harsh. But understandable. He communicated he was child free. And whether you wholeheartedly agreed or were just resigned. He was very clear. If you cannot support a child on your own, don't have it. Not in America, a country that despises its mothers and children. Dump them both. You're only 26. Realistically you have almost 20 years left to find someone who wants a kid. You shouldn't have to compromise what you want for your life. Especially for someone who's 10 years older than you. On to the next my love. Op. Real talk. 1. It's your body and he can't force you to do anything. 2. Your relationship with him is probably over outside of any expenses having to do with the child. And that will leave you as the primary parent. The relationship is over. Not to mention if you try to force him into something he doesn't want it can turn dangerous. It's time to leave. It is your choice but if Yal had a previous agreement that also doesn't just disappear. You two want different things. It's a deal breaker. Find someone who actually wants to be a father. Because that's what you are truly compatible with. You are going back on your word will not only impact his life but your future child's as well. Why doesn't daddy want to be in my life? Why does my dad hate me? Go talk to some people that are here as a result of an unwanted pregnancy. Get some perspective before you ruin not just one person's life. You really should do the considerate thing and have a child with a dad who isn't repulsed by their existence. It's not about you. Yes. It is a life. But that life will become a person and you're forcing an unpleasant reality onto them before they can even breathe for themselves. You're going to be single within just the next couple months so it's time to decide if you want to be single and child free or single mom. Only you can make that decision. But an almost 40-year-old man has decided he doesn't want kids is not going to change his mind. From here on out this will put a strain on your relationship that it is highly unlikely you will recover from. 
26 F 38 meters again with this sub. 1. Do a lot of soul searching about whether you decided yourself that you wanted to be child free. Or if your boyfriend pressured repeated it so much you felt like you had to be. Therapy would be good if you can get it ASAP. The fact that you wanted to be a mom for a long time. But a single year with your 12 year age gap BF was enough to change your mind concerns me a bit. 2. Do you have family support that can help you out with the baby? Are you financially stable on your own? The relationship is over. Have the abortion. You can always get pregnant from someone else who wants a child with you. Or who you will not know at all a donor for example and will not try to get into your life in the future to raise the child. After this, be happy that now you know you do want a child. And then have the child with someone else. Personally, I don't think anyone should have a child unless both parents are fully on board. You're 26. You have plenty of time to become a mother if that's what you want. But you should do it with someone who also wants to have a child. You should never have agreed to being child free. It wasn't what you really wanted. And you probably would have ended up resenting him for it. But that is moot now. If you want to keep the baby, then keep it. Like you said, it is your body. It doesn't sound like this relationship is going anywhere though. If you did keep it he will either disappear or do everything he can to make your life miserable. Why would you bring a kid into that? The kid will not thank you. They will be pissed that you selfishly decided to bring a kid into such a shitty situation. Most likely you will end up spending a fortune in custody battles and the kid will hate you for that too. Kids don't ask to be born. I think the best course of action would be to have an abortion. Break up with your partner. And then find a partner who wants to have children. It sounds like you want to have children. You don't have to be child free just because that's what your partner wants. You're still young and there's time to find a new partner and have children in the future. Do not expect your boyfriend to stay. He is being very clear. You will be a single mother from day zero. Either way the relationship is done. So make your decision knowing that. If he was so adamant about not having kids. He should have found time to get a vasectomy by now. Ultimately this is 100 your decision. Do whatever you would like to do. However. Be fully aware that you will be doing this completely on your own. Do not expect any help from him or for him to even be a part of your or your baby's life. If you are clinging to hope that he will see the baby and change his mind and everyone will live. Happily ever after. You are mistaken. Whatever decision you make. Base it upon that knowledge and not on the vision of a happy family that you may have in your head. If he cared so much about not having kids, he should have gotten snipped. I can see how this could be frustrating for him. But you didn't know what you know now. I wish this was as simple as a sincere heart-to-heart -heart explanation for you. I feel like if you could reach a point where anger of the situation is absolved, you too could get closure one way or another. Your body. Your life. But as soon as you are bought, I assure you he'll be gone. We have seen exactly that story here over and over again. OMG you're 26. You've got loads of time to be a mum. Dump this guy and move on to someone your own age. This is too big of a age gap honestly. Mid 20s to late 30s is just such a difference. Find someone who actively wants to be a parent with you. They exist it's not this guy. Don't tie yourself to him and his resentment for the rest of your life. 26 and 38 is a massive age gap. Do what you feel is best for you. This relationship has no hope. Don't factor him into your decisions. 